Hi friends, this is Anne from the Bible Diet. Today we're gonna make a video about some cabbage recipes. France, yes. Jamaica. Jamaica. Mm -hmm. And this is my sister Tashana, my sister from another mother but the same father. <laughs> and uh, she has um, very good talents and she has ministries also uh, that you can see on YouTube and, and Instagram and I will put the link down below. So I really recommend you to check it out. Alright, so we're gonna make some recipes and then we're gonna get the kids to try them and to decide which one is the best. Ooh. But it's not a competition, it's a friendly... <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> friendly. So we are gonna try different cabbage recipes and this one is the regular green cabbage you can find at any grocery store and yeah. this would be... Yeah. Summer cabbage that you can't find at any grocery yeah, store. Yeah, it's a little different. <laughs> yeah, it's like a, a curly cabbage, you know, it's called Savoy cabbage, you know. And yeah, but I think they'll all taste great. Yeah, I think so. And cabbage uh, has a lot of health benefits, especially for women. Mm -hmm. And maybe we can talk about that after. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get cooking. All right, so for the Jamaican recipe, we have um, sliced tomatoes, garlic, thyme, um, bell peppers are optional, and onions and the shredded cabbage. At the end of it, you can um, shred a carrot uh, inside of your recipe if you desire to do so, but it's optional. That is beautiful. And it smells delicious. I'm gonna add my tomatoes. So you're adding some salt, right? Mm -hmm. mm, yeah. The salt gives flavor, right? And then I'll flavor the uh, add some salt to this stir fry, and then once I start adding the cabbage, which I'm gonna do now, then I'll taste to see if it's sufficient, and I'll add a little bit more salt. Yeah, you gotta give flavor to the food. So one thing you want to do with the cabbage, you don't want to just put the lid on and steam it. You want to actually stir fry. So you want to take a few minutes to turn it and let it stir fry till it starts to wilt and simmer um, and then once it wilted then you just turn the stove down and let it simmer and the Jamaicans are of course across the finishing line first mm -hmm. yeah, <laughs> even though it's not a spring a little bit more complicated <laughs> <laughs> the French yes the but French it's good. it's good we can you see we can make delicious healthy simple recipes in no time so there is no excuse right none at all i'm steaming my cabbage for five minutes until they become a little bit soft i'm turning my uh, cabbage uh, halfway and i'm gonna leave it a few more minutes until it's uh, softer so my cabbage is nice and soft. I'm gonna turn off the heat, then I'm gonna drain my cabbage and let it cool down a little bit. So for my other ingredient, I get some tofu, uh, that's extra firm tofu, some parsley, some garlic, some onions, some carrots, and some bell peppers. Normally for the French recipe, it would require meat, but I'm gonna use tofu and we can add nice spices to give it a nice uh, flavor. So I'm gonna mash my tofu and then I'm gonna add my spices and my other ingredients. So I'm gonna add some spices and I'm gonna add some salt, some uh, paprika, you can use smoked paprika as well, some turmeric and some garlic powder and you can also put onion powder but I don't have any so you know if you're missing one ingredient it's fine you know it's not the end of the world and I'm sure it's still gonna taste good you know you can do with what you have and you can be creative as well you can even add other ingredients that you might like and now I'm gonna add my other ingredients And I'm gonna mix up everything together. Okay. Here we 
gonna transfer into a deeper bowl. It's gonna be easier. I have a lot of ingredients here. So now I'm gonna stuff my cabbage leaves with some of my tofu mix, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna hold everything together with a cooking string. I'm gonna make a quick tomato sauce and then I'm gonna put it over my cabbage and then I'm gonna put my cabbage in the oven at 350 degrees for one hour. So for my uh, quick tomato sauce I'm just gonna take some tomato paste and I'm gonna add some water and some spices and that's it. Some water. I'm gonna add some olive oil too. Some nice touch to the tomato sauce. So I'm gonna put some garlic powder, some salt, some rosemary, and I'm putting a little bit of stevia, or you can add a little tiny bit of uh, brown sugar if you want, to uh, remove the acidity of the sauce. And that's optional. And that's it, we got a very quick, uh, nice tomato sauce. So I'm gonna put my stuffed cabbage in the pan and then I'm gonna put it in the oven at 350 degrees for about an hour. I'm gonna add some tomato sauce on top. So while it's cooking, we're gonna tell you a few health benefits of cabbage. So what health benefits do you know? I do know that the cabbage is really good for detoxing um, and I believe it helps to balance out the hormones, especially women if you're experiencing some hormonal imbalances, cabbages are really good at helping you balance your hormones. Yeah, I believe it has a, a good uh, impact on the liver and it push out some extra estrogen that you may have in estrogen <laughs> that you may have in the body mm -hmm. and uh, women, I really recommend that you eat cabbage maybe even every day. Like even if it's a, uh, you get kale, you get broccoli, you get uh, cauliflower. I think it's the same. Same family. Yeah, a red cabbage. You know, and try to eat often. It's very good for you. And it's delicious. And it's delicious. Yes, it is. And I, uh, I love this uh, vegetable because it's not even expensive. You know, and it's very healthy. So yeah. And I believe we can make poultices with cabbage too. Yes, poultices. It is um, good for like joint pains and reducing inflammation in the joint. Yeah. So if you put like a get a leaf of cabbage and you wrap it over your knee or your yeah. joint, your ankle, whatever hurts, and heat it up, um, it'll help to pull the inflammation out of your joints as well. Yeah, exactly. And there are many also health benefits that if we tell you would be here also tonight. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, maybe we mention some in the description below. Guys, you're ready to try the cabbage recipe? Mm. 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 Nam nam nam! Alright, let's try some of this. Mm. Mm. Oh, yeah. mm. And uh, you can try some of the tofu. Mm. Now we're gonna try this one that looks so yummy. And I tried it and it's delicious. Mm. Mm. Is it good, guys? Mm -hmm. So you guys can see that it, it was very easy to do, it's delicious, and it's also very healthy. Yes, you can't, you don't have to make complicated recipes to eat healthy, uh, even if you don't have a lot of time. You know, you can take a cabbage, put some onions, garlic, spices, and stir fry. It tastes very good with rice. Mm. And uh, yeah, you can make it even a little bit more extravagant, I think. Yes, the French yes. recipe was very extravagant. Actually, very nice. we were, yeah, we were supposed. I was supposed to make the same thing, and I realized, oh, well, we're gonna make the same thing. So I said, you know what? Let me find.
find something that is different and yeah, I remember this recipe that my mom made when I was a little child and it's the first time I made it. And uh, it's good, you can use tofu and uh, it tastes very good. So yeah, we encourage you to, to try it. And as you can see, uh, everybody liked it, even the children. And um, yeah, be encouraged and, and do your best, you know, uh, to eat healthy and you know, God will do the rest. And uh, yeah, and I really encourage you to check out my sister um, Instagram and YouTube channel because it has helped me, it has inspired me and many others and I'm sure it will be a blessing to you as well. <laughs> Alright, um, be blessed and uh, we'll talk to you later. Say again? No, I'm just... I'm just... <laughs> Hello, this is Tashana presenting the cabbage, uh, also known as the shoe in France. <laughs>